Hey, what's up? I'm Kevin Rudolph. You're watching VladTV.com. Check it out. Would you say the Jersey Shore get crunk? Oh, sorry. Huh? Would you say the Jersey Shore get crunk? Would that be uh, part of your definition of crunk? Well, they're going to get crunk tonight because they're hanging out with me. I think I'm going to probably drink everybody out of the table. So. Yeah? Well, what's your favorite Jersey Shore character? Uh, good friend of mine is Paulie D, so I say Paulie D is the home. And he's a DJ. So, uh, how would you rate his DJ skills as a DJ yourself? I have never heard him spin. I'm going to listen to him when I go in. I think he's on right now. Oh, he's getting on. You get so, on? I'm going to check him out. Yeah. And then I get on later. Y'all check me out. Little John. Yeah. Uh, if you could be with any of the girls on Jersey Shore, <laughs> and you were single, because I know you're not, but if you were single, which one would it be? Can I say I'll take them all? Take them all? Yeah. Is that, is that a, so, so no, no Snooki favorites? No, Snooki's, Snooki's got a little vibe. To, yeah. I have a little, yeah. Snooki's got a little vibe, so I like to go with a bit of loom. You know what I mean? I feel it. Uh, how do you feel about the Dreamer and Christina Milian breaking up? I mean, you know, it's sad because I know they've been together for a, for a minute. So, they, they, you know, the music industry celebrity is hard to deal with that. So, you know, I just hope they both get over it and right. find some happiness. And you just filmed two new videos, I heard? Yes. So, it's a song called Break Your Back and a song called 2012. Yeah. Trust me, we're taking over some of this time. That's what it is, baby. Yeah, man. Yeah. All right. So, what's it like working in the whole cash money system? It's, uh, it, it, you know what, Cash Money is a family, it's like a brotherhood, it's like, uh, you know, we all kind of help each other out and get another, each other's records, and Wayne obviously helped me get on the map a lot, so, you know, they've been great to me since day one, and, uh, you know, it's definitely a different kind of situation than any other record label, but, you know, it, it, it put me on the map, and I always appreciate love and respect them for that. With Wayne helping you out so much, how does it feel with him being in jail right now? I mean, it's sad. It's what he's what he's going through. But I think everything happens for a reason, and you know he'll learn and grow, and or not learn any or whatever. I mean, it's what can you say? It's it is what it is, and and you know he'll get through it. He'll be stronger, and life will go on. Have you talked to him since he's been locked up? I haven't, but I talk to him, talk to him like all the time, and, and I all I hear is that you know he's he's got it together, and he's he's adjusted, and he's stable and he's, you know, he'll get through it. He's coming out soon, so. What do you think, him. what do you think really makes Wayne the megastar that he is? Um, I think what, what makes him connect to people is his belief in himself, you know, he has a really unwavering confidence, and I think that's actually what makes him connect to people, you know, that you can really be whoever the F you want to be. But with being in the Cash Money family, how do you feel about the whole little Kim Nicki Minaj thing? I don't get involved. Next. Okay. I got you. <laughs>